Something magic happens Every time you go You make the magic happen The magic of Orioles baseball Hey guys, how's everybody doing today? Autographs 2000 here. And in today's video, I have got five autographs through the mail, TTMs. And we're going to open the last pack of the Bowman 2023. I'm um, starting things off. We've got a TTM. It is from Orlando, Florida. And we have got Wayne Granger. He signed three of three in 10 days. He had a career record of 35 and 35 with a 3.14 ERA. He also had 108 saves. He played nine years. He appeared in 451 games. He played from 68 to 76. And he played with St. Louis, Cincinnati, Minnesota, the Yankees, the White Sox, the Astros, and the Expos. <clears throat> Um, 1970, he went 6-5 and five with a 2.66 ERA, and he also led the league with 35 saves. Um, at that time, 35 saves was the uh, National League record. He also finished 8th in the Cy Young voting, and he finished 30th in the MVP voting that year. That was in 1970. Uh, the year before was 19, uh, the year before in 1969, he went nine and six with 27 saves and he finished 15th in the MVP voting. Um, he won the Fireman of the Year both years and he is also in the Cincinnati Reds Hall of Fame. Wayne Granger. All right, our next return is from West Palm Beach, Florida. And we have got Mike Loind. <clears throat> He's, he signed three of three in 289 days. He had a career record of three and seven with a 5.82 ERA. He played two years. He appeared in 35 games. He played in 86 and 87. And he spent his entire career with the Texas Rangers. As you can see in the background, the Hawks turned up body slamming uh, Sergeant Slaughter. <laughs> All right, our next return is from Carroll Stream, Illinois. And we have got a football return. We have got Tom Waddle. He signed 404 in eight days. During his career, he had 173 receptions with 2,109 yards. He also had nine touchdowns. He played six years. He appeared in 60 games. He played from 89 to 94. And he spent his entire career with the Chicago Bears. Tom Waddle. All right, our next return is from North Houston, Texas. And we have got Ken Aspromonte. He signed two of three in 10 days. <clears throat> he had a career batting average of 249 with 19 home runs, 124 RBIs. He played seven years. He appeared in 475 games. He played from 57 to 63. 
and he played with Boston, the Senators, Cleveland, the Angels, the Mil uh, Milwaukee Braves, and the Chicago Cubs. <clears throat> His best year was in 1960 when he hit 10 home runs, knocked in 48, and batted 290 with a career best four stolen bases. And then when his playing days were over, he became the manager of Cleveland from 72 to 74. And during that time, he, he compiled a record of 220 wins with 260 losses. And before we get to our last return, we're gonna go ahead and open up this last pack of Bowman. After this pack, we're going to have to figure out what we're going to open next. All right, we have got Trey Turner, Wilson Contreras, Fernando Tatis Jr., Max Mayer. We got Justin Verlander, Mike Trout. We have got Noel V. Marte, number 13 prospect. We have got Cedadine Rafaela, Jose DePala. We got Junior Caminero, Luis Rodriguez, and Javier Osorio. So, not the best pack. All right, our last return is from Richmond, Virginia. We have got Jordan Westberg. He signed one of two in 10 days. He is currently playing in AAA with the Norfolk Tides in the Baltimore Orioles organization. Um, during his career, he's got a 277 batting average with 59 home runs, 237 RBIs, and he's also got 34 steals. This year, he is batting 291 with 17 home runs, 52 RBIs, and five stolen bases. He is the Baltimore Orioles number three overall prospect. And he is the number 48 overall prospect in all of uh, Major League Baseball. And that is Jordan Westberg, current player. So I was really, really happy to get that card back as he is a definitely, he is, he is definitely a stud. And he is part of the future for the Baltimore Orioles. And again, very happy to get him back. And that is also a 2023 Bowman card that he signed. All right, guys, that's going to do it for this video. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, please smash that like button. If you have not subscribed yet, please do so. And until next time, guys. Autographs 2000 is out.